This is Alin from Javelin. In a previous video, I showed you how to use appearances as selection groups in such a way that you would be able to select multiple entities in bulk and apply different commands to them. In this video, I will show you a different technique for selecting multiple faces with one quick key stroke combination and applied draft on all of them. So first of all, let's see what kind of draft we need to apply. If I'm doing a draft analysis, based on a pull direction normal to this face and a 3 degree draft, you can see that I have 16 faces that need draft applied on. So let's do apply draft. Instead of using the manual draft, I'm going to go to the draft expert this time. You have to be aware that the only limitation for the draft expert is the fact that it can do only neutral plane draft. So let's select a phase that's going to define the neutral plane. And if I have the draft analysis on, asking SOLIDWORKS to auto-paint the faces, you can see that right away separates them in faces that already have positive draft, negative draft, and faces that need draft. And you can even hide the one that already have draft applied on. And as you can see, the ones that are left are the ones that need draft. Also notice that the phase, the uh, field that is blue is this one. So SOLIDWORKS is asking me now to select faces. So the entity that is looking for for selections is the face. How can I select all the faces that are visible right now? Well, if I press Ctrl A, it's going to select all the entities of the same type. And since this field was looking for faces, it's not going to select edges or vertices. It goes directly to faces. The moment I hit apply, a draft is going to be applied to all these faces. So if I turn on again, the visibility of uh, the faces that already have draft, as you can see, everything is fine. As you can see, the draft has been applied. If I'm doing a draft analysis one more time, just to prove that that's the case, I don't have any face that requires draft. Thank you. Thank you.